Also from the night team, an alarming attack in Lemonster. A man arrested after police say he ran after a school bus, whacking it with a machete. Wait till you hear the, the, the reason why here. Here's the night team's Justin Bork. He's live in Lemonster to pick up the story. Justin? And Adam, this all happened yesterday morning. This bus pulled into the driveway behind me and turned around as part of its normal morning route when this alleged attack occurred. And not only that, this is a wheelchair accessible van for special needs students. Last three years we've been doing this, never had a problem. Elizabeth Price says she's never been afraid to drop her special needs son off at the bus every morning. He hops on right outside her door, well out of the way of the busy street. It's a wheelchair accessible van, so we have to put him into the back of the van. That's why they don't stop up there, is because if traffic doesn't stop in time, someone's losing their life. That all changed Wednesday morning. Lemonster police say an angry neighbor, 44-year-old Ricardo Morales, ran outside with a machete and a broomstick just as the bus made its normal turnaround in the shared driveway, yelling and screaming, then attacking the bus just as Price's son was getting ready to board. Police say he was upset that the bus was using his driveway. We're actually, we're friends with the guy. Price says she had never seen that kind of behavior from her neighbor, but police say this isn't the first time they've dealt with him. He was charged last December in a home invasion, in which police claim he pointed a gun at a five-year-old. Morales now ordered held without bail as he awaits a dangerousness hearing in Fitchburg court next week. Now, the good news here, neither the students nor the bus driver were harmed. And after having to stop for a while to interview with police, they did end up making it to school okay. We're live in Lemonster, Justin Bork, 7 News, 19.